In this video, I want to explain the five dimensions to you. There's a lot of confusion about this, not only online, also in literature. So I want to explain the five dimensions in simple terms to you. So to do that, I've made some notes on my whiteboard. So if you can see it. A dimension is a method of perception. So a dimension is simply how you perceive something that's out there. A dimension is also a level on which you influence the physical world around you. Now we as human beings, we are spirit beings with physical extensions, the physical extension of our bodies. So we're not physical creatures. We are spirit beings with a physical extension. And our physical extensions right now are mortal, and when Christ comes back, we'll get immortal physical extensions, immortal bodies, which are forever young. But anyway, what are the five dimensions? Now, the first three are obvious. Number one, height. What? Weight. Content. How high, how wide, and what's in it? Well, this is obvious. As I've shown over here. Those are the basic ones. And those, these are the base of the physical world. Height, width, and content, what it is. That's obvious. Now the fourth dimension that you see over here is duration. Now, time is how we measure duration. And duration is something that happens naturally in the permanent now. Because there, there's only the permanent now. That is eternity. Eternity is the permanent now. Time is a measurement of how we divide moments within the permanent now. That's so why you have the past, the present, this was happening at the moment, and then how then what will happen next. So that's duration. Now, duration has to do with your experience. So that's both on a physical level as well as a metaphysical level. The metaphysical level is the phase between the physical and the spiritual. It simply means, metaphysical simply means that you as a spirit being are affecting the physical. That's metaphysical. All right? Now, those are the four dimensions. Height, width, content, duration. And how you measure duration is called time. Time is something we human beings made, not the Heavenly Father. The Heavenly Father just made day and night, and we measure day and night. Now, the fifth dimension is flexibility. In the fifth dimension, you as a spirit being, you're, you're so connected to the electromagnetic field of the Earth that you're able to use the electromagnetic field of the Earth to affect circ physical circumstances far away from you, without being there physically. Now, in the, in the occult, that means those that do paranormal stuff, they can use demonic aids, so aid of demons, to ask for projection, means leaving the body temporarily and come back. But that's not the family father's design. The family father's design is that you're always in your body, which is your physical extension, and within that physical extension of the body, you have an impact on the environment around you. Now, this is on a metaphysical level that affects the physical. And in order for this to happen, you ought to be active on a spirit level. So, these are the five dimensions. There's a method of perception and also the strategies on how you want to affect the physical realm. Now, if you want to, if you want to do something physical, like building a house, you have to do it on this level. And there's also duration that comes into play. But if you want to, let's say, affect your cash flow, or you want to affect uh, the mood in, a, in an environment, this is the dimension of operating. Well, I hope this is all clear to you. If there are any questions, feel free to ask them. Be at peace.